The greatest question that an average individual will be asking today is, what is the mind? The mind can be defined as a person's set of intellectual or mental faculties. The mind has become one of the most dominant factors of the human body that makes it possible that what we learn today and what we know today, we can process it and we can understand it. But because of the nature of the things happening and because of the ways that the lives of men had been going, what are the basic things that we should know about the mind? Left for me alone in this snippet today, the mind for me is nothing but what the Lord have decided that it is. Other people might have every other thing that are related to it but i believe the scriptures according to the bible in the book of philippians chapter 2 verse 5 paul speaking to the church said let this mind be in you that was also found in christ jesus the intent of the lord is to make sure that we reason like christ that we become like christ that we walk like christ that we talk like christ Jesus is the only one that was able to display the right mindset towards life and towards godliness and towards every form of ideas based on human knowledge and understanding. You need to think like Jesus in your workplace. You need to think like Jesus as a student. You need to think like Jesus. You need to adopt the ideas based on Jesus. And how would that be possible? You have to feel the mind. You have to feel the mind. You have to feel the mind. I repeat again. You have to feel the mind with the word of the Lord. With the word of the Lord. Then you can understand what the mind is all about. This is a little snippet from Mark Sock Network. I hope it blessed you. See you next week.